Hello and welcome to Kipo's Creative Flow. We are going to see a baby today, a new baby that's been born, a little girl. And I've already prepped the card, so I've used like a thread with multiple colours on there to, well, first we created the holes with the pattern and then we threaded it so that you go through one and then you go into the next one and then you go to the opposite side so it kind of creates this um spirulina spirulina is that what it's called spirulina effect i think it's called um so what i was thinking of doing is personalizing this so we're, we're, when we go later on today um it's all ready so first thing i'm going to do is use antique linen just to distress um the edges and um, some of the envelope just so that before we start the stamping so we do need to actually glue glue that bit down where you can see the thread because it's a triple fold so I will glue that bit down unless there's anything else I think of adding on there um, let's just ink first and then decide Hope you guys are doing okay. I think I'm going to have to concentrate on university stuff tomorrow. So you see as we've got this program tonight. So it's, um, we'll be going from, it's going to be between 5pm and 10pm. And there's going to be like a congregation at the Gordora, which is the Sikh place of worship. And we'll be singing there yeah, together. So it'll be pretty cool. And we'll catch up with people we haven't seen for a while as well, I'm sure. Because we have... Um... Actually, I'm wondering if I should... Oh, that's just spare. Oh, I was wondering, that's a bit long. Oh, that's spare as well. Anyone, anyone else? No, that's okay. Okay, I'm wondering, shall I just glue that first? Or shall we stamp first? Yeah, let's stamp first. Actually, let's finish off the envelope. And then if we have time, we'll... Um, I've got some tissue paper out and a bag from Monsoon, a gift bag, which I always like to upcycle bags that I've already received. I try not to buy anymore but i won't i won't be adding anything to it or anything um it's just yeah just replacing the gifts in there yeah i did ask her what does she need specifically for the child but um she was just like just come down it's fine so i was like no I was going to put money in first so they could buy something what they'd like but then when I spotted that then I, the baby comes to play group now so yeah I had to get it it just matched her personality and she wanted um, she's saying she likes watching people the baby does um, so this well, I'll, sh I'll show you shortly but um, that will help us sit up as well really cute let's do this as well while we're here all right sorry about that i could have inked that beforehand sorry all right let's pop you in there um oops let's pop you in there and i've got my foam so well it's not quite it's not soft but it's a foam mat and i've got some letters here so got some studio g stamps clear stamps these are from like 2006 and these are alphabet ones this is 2008 and then we've got these by royal langnickel these were from a shop called dunelm and they do like haberdashery and things like that or household things that was on sale there i think i bought that from then it says you're so tweet <laughs> that's so cute 
either by Marian Anderson. Um, not sure if I'm going to be using that, but I've pulled it out anyway. And then we're definitely going to be using these. So I thought I'd use the. These are from Hobbycraft. They're called Clear Alphabet Stamps. You can what, use whatever you've got. If you, know, have, if you haven't got any, then just use um, magazine cutouts if you want. So the first thing. Oh yeah. So the first thing I was thinking is let's put. Um, it's a good, no. Should we put a new baby girl? I suppose she's not new now. <laughs> We'll put it the girl, and then we'll put the name at the bottom here. So I'm just gonna ink this up. I think I've used the boy one quite a few times. I don't think I've used this girl one. I'm just doing some gentle tapping. Um, it's a risk to go straight onto here because it's a bobbly cardstock as well. It's got like a texture, hammered texture to it, but we're just gonna go for it. Um, oh, I do. Okay. Not bad. Got a bit of um, ink around the edges, unfortunately. It's okay. Um, and then let's go in with the. So her name begins with a T. I don't know how we're going to fit it all in though. We can try, right? So. I need to do a gentle tap on this. This is quite juicy still. So I'm gonna write I'm gonna write it right on the edge of the T and then we want E Oops Daisy Actually I might just do it as is so the curly bits on the bottom So we got T, E, H, I, J, H, I, J. Oops. Don't lose, don't lose this space. Don't lose your spaces, guys. <laughs> okay. So this is a J. Okay. What my hand there? Just a bit. I'm just wiping off on the excess. So we've got T E J. Don't think we need the J again. Okay, oh well. So we've got stage. Okay. The back of the thing, I don't know. <laughs> Just use this stage, and then we've got v, v. Very tricky. So we've got V A N. Keep dropping them. V A N. We need N. O N N here. A N turn it round T Q oh. Yeah, that is an S. <laughs> oh no, don't go over there. The E keeps falling off. So S is here. Stage one. S 
No, this A. Where the the E is the one that keeps falling off. T E yeah. And V the lower orbits and the bottom. V luckily it's just another E. And then we've got kicking K. I hope it all fits. Okay. Okay. Um. We got a. You are a. Yeah. <laughs> check in. Check in. A. A. We are an NLVQ. U R No, that's T R is it? Can't, I don't know my alphabet Oh no, that's T What are you doing? Oh, that is an R. It just looks so funny. On the final letter. Is it R? We did it! <laughs> okay. We're going to have to sort these out in a sec. That's our name. Oh, it's so cute. Um, so what we can do as well. Is let's put. bit of inking on special delivery because it's going to be hand delivered so let's add a little stamp there and just to match the stalk on the card we can use this stalk as well just for fun god don't break it <laughs> person's name there okay and maybe we can do a a little oop, rattle on the opening of it oh no that's very messy. Okay. So that is what we've got so far. And now let's uh oh, should I I might um grab some glue. I might use the, yeah I'll use the fabric tack just to make sure it does stick properly. Oh, it's already coming out. Okay then, I did have it upside down to be fair. Okay, I'm just gonna turn that. Ooh. Let's just grab the back of this fork, and it kind of will have all that in place as well. Ready? We are going that way, yeah? Yep, double check you. <laughs> I'm just wondering, do we want any other stamping while we've got them out? This one is quite cute.
Maybe we'll just add the two little birdies on the bottom here. Gosh, <laughs> really over inking today. Sorry about that. Pad. Cool, okay. that's all ready ready to go and then we can sign that and then so that bit is done I'm just gonna pop this up here out the way and then so this is the monsoon bag I was talking about I know it's not brand new obviously but it will totally be the right, right size for what we're about to put in it. So I'll just grab. So the first thing is this cute little outfit, six to nine months. And it's got these tights in it and it's, yeah, it's very adorable. So cute. And it will, it will definitely suit her when she's old enough to wear it. So I'm thinking maybe I'll just leave the hanger in Oops. and also tuck the tights in and give it a little fold, maybe even fold in the hanger. And I've got this tissue paper, which is in. the only trouble is the other thing is quite humongous. Actually, you know what, you know the tissue paper? We could just cover it on the top and we could just actually put the items in like this. So that's what I'll do, I think. But I love the colour of it. So I'll just grab. So this little friend I found in. Um... Look at him, he's so adorable. I found it in B&M and it was £15, but look. How cute is that? And she was on, and it might help um, her sit up as well because she's not that very old. So, yeah, look. Try not to burn him <laughs> with the candle. But yeah, he's adorable. He's so fluffy. So, I'm just going to pop him in the bag. And then we can just add the tissue paper. So, I'll put the, I'll put the outfit in at the bottom. Oh put the outfit in at the bottom. Great. And then we'll put him in. He's going to really fill it out with me. You can get in there, can't you? You can definitely get in there. Oh, so cute. Yeah, my daughter was going crazy over him when we brought him home. Just about got him off, off her got it off her. <laughs> so let's put the ears in this. He's so cute. And then um got this cover. So this is actually you could leave it folded and then just tuck it in. I hope she doesn't think it's actually from Monsoon Welcome. <laughs> so that is a very expensive shop. And they do do like baby clothes and stuff like that, but anyway. So yeah, so that's it. Thanks for um thanks for stopping by. And hopefully see you soon. Take care. Bye.